Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to another video. My name is Amethyst, and ladies and gentlemen, what a wonderful day! Say it with me, chat. Chat, say it with me. Right now, what a wonderful day it is today. Because Wuthering Waves has done the very thing we hoped it would do. It has broken the 30 million pre-registration. What a wonderful day indeed. Say it with me, people. What a wonderful day. Say what a wonderful day because it really is a wonderful day. What a wonderful day. What a wonderful day for, uh, for Wuthering Waves. As it surpasses the 30 million, 30 million pre-registrations. It's now 30,500,000 30, pre-registrations. That is absolutely insane. Which means if we go over here at 5 million shell credits, at 10 million advanced resonance potions, at 15 million asteroid, which is the premium currency, which is good. At 20 million sigil en route, I'm not too sure what this is. But if it's, if it's above the premium currency, it's going to be worth something. And at the 30 million mark, ladies and gentlemen, the lustrous tide times 20, which means two free temples, which is insane. Not only are we getting like, I think we're getting like, I think free to play wise, if you do everything, it has been calculated, you can get 270 pulls on launch on Wuthering Waves just by doing everything everything in the game which means we're getting near enough 300 three, if you do everything in the game by the time you've done as much as you possibly can 300 pulls is what you would be the equivalent to if you if, 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 if you if you must do that math if someone else did it for me I didn't do it and then obviously we're getting a free five star weapon oh no sorry four star weapon I think this isn't I don't think this is five star I think this is four star free four star weapon of our choice out of gauntlets, out of a um, uh, sword, out of a um, rectifier, a uh, revolver, and a great sword. What else do we have here? Oh yeah, we also did do the five star echo event as well. Very, very nice. Here we have all of the characters here. Here, here, we, here is my free five star that I will be claiming because you get a free five star on launch. You get a five star selector. And then you summon for your five star. There is no 50-50. You get the five star that you were you requested. Look at this. Look at these characters. There's my wife. There's my wife. Wait, where'd she go? No, no, no. Well, there she is. There's my wife. There's another really cool. Here's my here's my boy, Cal Caro. He actually looks insane. Actually looks insane. I can't wait for this game. Look at this! It looks so good! It looks so good. Everything about this game looks so, so good. Oh, look at, look at Gian just staring at the face of this demon. Everything about this game looks absolutely amazing. And the fact that it's now surpassed 30 million pre-registrations is fucking, I'm at, didn't mean to do that. Is absolutely amazing. 30 million pre-registrations when a lot of people, and I know a lot of people, you bastards out there, you bastards, you Genshin stands, not the Genshin fans. You guys can sometimes be quite respectable. You bastards, you Hoyo first dick sucking bastards. So this wouldn't happen. This wouldn't happen. And saying that half of these are botted. No. Shut the hell up, man. Shut the hell up, man. Jianxing, my future main. Well, Jianxing is your future main. Yeah, Junshin's pretty cool. But the fact that we uh, we have managed to break 30 million uh, pre-registrations is absolutely insane. I'm very proud of the community. I'm very proud of how positive this community's been in ignoring all of the haters, ignoring all of the people that said it wouldn't do well. We're, 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 the fact that it's 30 million 500,000 pre-registrations at start tells me there's gonna be 30, over 30 million players upon launch playing this game now granted like every gacha game like every game it will peak and then it will decline after the first month that is natural but the fact within the first month we're gonna have over 30 million people playing this game is insane to me 
absolutely insane. I will pretend like I understand what's going on and be happy for you, fam. Brother, Wuthering Waves is going to be an insane game. If you have a PC, which I know you do, when this game comes out, give it a go. Just give it a go. It's going to be a free-to-play game. Give it a go. You don't need to play any other gacha game to understand what's going on. Just watch some gameplay. Watch the trailers. Watch the watch the characters. Like gameplay, what we've seen so far. And just enjoy yourself playing the game. If it's not for you, I understand. However, if you're a fan of anime, like I am. If you're a fan of RPG games, like, like you know, like anime open world RPG games. If you like Final Fantasy. If you like... You know, if you like hard boss fights, like Souls-like boss fights, this will be the game for you. This will be the game for you. It's the same. Tris, are you not playing? Tris, are you are you not playing this game? Are you, are you not looking forward to this game? Because I certainly am. Like I said, the fact that they've they've got here, the fact that they have got here is absolutely insane to me. Very, very good for the game. Very, very good for the game. Uh, and yeah, I just wanted to take the opportunity and make this video to congratulate each and every single Wuthering Waves fan that has um, been waiting for this game as long as I have for many, 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 many months. I've been, I've been excited for this game since the CBT one last year because I knew that the game was 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 coming, but I didn't know when. I saw many content creators say watch out for this game, so I kept my eye out. Then the CPT-1 came out, and then people were leaking a little, or showing a little bit of the gameplay from the CPT-1. And then I just kept my eyes open, and as time went on, I got more and more and more excited. And now we are literally exactly, exactly 10 days away. 10 days away from this game, which is going to be insane. I am, I am, just don't understand half the stuff, only the characters. Oh, okay, I'm with you, I'm with you, with you. Same here, actually. Saw some leaks on TikTok and been waiting for it ever since. Good! Everyone here in the chat seems to be very, um, very positive, hyper positive about this game, and that's good, you should be. This is going to be a very good game, and I cannot wait to see everyone's reaction when the game launches. I saw someone saying on Twitter that this game is going to do, or someone on YouTube, I saw a clip of some random guy, a streamer, content creator, say this game is going to do abysmal abysmal like absolutely dog shizer like dog water hogwash and to you sir i say sh respectfully shut the fuck up and just keep every single negative opinion neg ultra negative opinion to yourself there's constructive criticism there's respectful criticism then there's you <laughs> There's people like you that just want to put the game down going, I don't think the game's going to do well. Why? I just don't. It's not going to be Genshin. It's not going to match Genshin. It's not trying to match Genshin. So shut up. Uh, just just accept and enjoy the game for what it is. I like the darker vibes. Yeah, the darker grading and the darker character designs and the darker story looks really, really good. Really, really looking forward to it. And the fact that their marketing has got so far beyond, they're now like, they, 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 they like rented out. Kuro Games rented out. Times Square, New York. Every single screen, and there's a lot of them, in Times Square, New York, was rented out for like a 10 minute period or 20 minute period, and they were showing gameplay, character showcases, and, tra and a brand new story trailer for Wuthering Waves all over Times Square. There's a video on YouTube about it. There's, my YouTube, there's a video on my YouTube about it. There's a video. There's, there's, there's YouTube content everywhere about it. Everyone's talking about it. So um, yeah, they they they're, they're marketing. They they're taking it very serious seriously, um, which is very very good. Remember when like a month and a bit ago, just after the live stream, everyone was like the problem through the start of April was like there's no marketing. Kuro Games saw that and was like, I put I took that personally. Marketing, 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 marketing. The, oh, oh, New York, bang, Times Square, rented. Like, it's absolutely insane. And I just want to congratulate each and every one of the fans and congratulate Kuro Games. You have done an amazing job. And yeah, I, 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 I just can't wait to see how this game uh, unravels. But thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Take it easy, everyone.